both religious clergy versus secular clergy. Uh, yes, of course, one thing is the institutional structure of churches and all religions. Another thing is the extent to which there are ethics, precisely social ethics, political ethics, and this is why the work of Max Weber is so interesting. Because on the one hand, he claimed that there are carriers of his religion, which are kind of the key that have shaped the religion. But then there is a dynamic, once a religion goes in a particular direction, that has a specific social ethics, a specific political ethics, etc. And, and we see that, uh, obviously, Catholicism is not only whatever the Pope in Rome says. There are all kinds of dynamics which are Catholic, even when they are not within the church. Charles Taylor is a great Catholic thinker, whether he you know, it's irrele irrelevant whether he's, he's a heretic, of course, but a great Catholic thinker, <laughs> a great Catholic thinker. And uh, there is a Catholic tradition, which is part of this, so, uh, um, but he's obviously not, whether he goes to church or not, I don't know, and I don't care. But uh, it, this is not the issue, that indeed we think in certain ways, and, and, and there are ways of thinking that are part of this process, yes. And of course, the interesting question is how we all, uh, the whole globe, all these competing ethics, as we enter into, as long as we all live separately, we all could have our own ethics and who couldn't care. Mm -hmm. But we are going to enter into a situation in which we will have to make the globe as a whole very serious questions concerning bioethics, concerning environmental issues, and these ethical traditions are going to influence, influence these debates. So as more and more uh, uh, it will be in our hands and in scientific hands to open up Pandora boxes in the process of solving problems, then we'll have to have all kinds of ethical discussions in which uh, the different ethical traditions of humanity are going to have to participate because nobody's going to be able to impose a solution on anybody. But the idea that somehow this has to be only precisely because of that you need a secular, globa global secularity because if you get the religion seen it's a mess, well, no, because this global secularity we know is a form of Western Christian secularity and the other people are not going to accept it as, 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 as really global and cosmopolitan and they will see it as, as somewhat Christian. So. 